Thursday, the Edward M. Calville Cancer Foundation will be holding their second annual Guam is Good Wine Tasting and Art Show, which will feature some amazing works of art by a great panel of individuals. Joining me now with the foundation is Jennifer Calville Kitigua and from MidPAC Marketing Manager James Castro. Hafade and welcome to Harmon. Hafade. All right, great to have you here. Now, as I said, this is the second annual um, event, Jennifer, and it's done so much good for the community, and it's a very, very fun event and everything. So wine tasting and art show, kind of self-explanatory, but tell us exactly what's going to happen. Um, what's going to happen is, is this, a, this is a very unique event. Um, it's worthwhile for the foundation because this is the only place that um, um, local residents will be able to see art that's been done by local physicians, um, business people, public servants, and then also some artists in the community. Okay, well that, that's a great teaser. So who are some of the, uh, the artists that have created these pieces? Um, some of the artists that we feature um, are Dr. Shea, um, Arlene Steffi, who's a, an ethnographer and oral historian. Mm -hmm. um, in addition, we have Brant McCready from Contenders Gym, um, KUAM's own Mindy Uggen, Claire Calville smith from Synergy Studios, um, some students from Mount Carmel who contributed a piece on behalf of attorney Mike Phillips, um, Carmen Leva from Carmen's Cha Cha Cha, Shelly Capo, the Dining Diva, um, Rinjati Limtiako from Pacific Daily News, Arlene Steffi, um, Patty Arroyo, and Ronnie Calvo Perez from Cup and Saucer. Mm -hmm. Well, the veritable who's who of people in the community, and you're actually going to be able to see exactly how talented they are and how they've expressed themselves and how they want to share and give back to um, the cause. And of course, the theme of the art show is Guam is Good, which is also the uh, slogan of the foundation. Um, explain why for people that may not know. Okay, um, Guam is Good is a uh, the phrase that my grandfather um, uttered to his mother, my great-grandmother, before he passed away uh, from cancer in 2004. So naturally, uh, we adopted that as the slogan for the foundation. Um, it obviously has special uh, s sentimental significance you know, to people in my family. Um, but since we've started the foundation, um, it's kind of a, it has a new meaning of its own, just taken on a life of its own, um, just based on the generosity of people in the community. Um, I think it's really now a reflection of everyone that's contributed and, and the fact that we've been able to um, give back to local cancer patients. Okay. Um, well, well, James, let's go to you for our next question because <coughs> course, uh, Excuse me. the foundation and the sponsor restaurants will be serving like a great variety of, of spirits and of food and everything like that. What can people expect, you know, aside from this beautiful art that we'll get to in a minute? How about well, food? you know, long, it's nothing better it, by enjoying, uh, in, in, enjoying art and drinking your favorite wines, right? So I mean, back in IWS, we have some of the best wines available and some of the great food that's gonna be there as well. We're pairing it with our wines. Uh, we will have a, a Japanese station that's gonna have a sort of sushi, tempura, karagi, fried rice, and gyoza. And we're gonna serve that along with like the Devil's Lair Fifth Leg Sauvignon Blanc. It's an Australian wine, very crisp, very good. And a Gulf Station Pinot Grigio. So if you like wine, you're gonna wanna come and try it out. Uh, our opening cocktail starts with a Cinzano Asti Spumante. Doesn't that sound just so good? I was, I was going to say, the more exotic <laughs> and more typically the better it is. Right, right. And so that's a very, very sweet wine. It's a very good wine. And uh, it, it's just going to be a whole evening of great food, Mexican food and great wines with the Yara Valley Estate grown Shiraz uh, Vino Nuer. All right. <laughs> I, I just love how, how to pronounce these things. Um, cheese and crackers. We have a Kendall Jackson Grand Reserve Cabernet Sauvignon. Uh, as well as a Gra Kendall Jackson Grand Reserve Chardonnay and Hartford Court Russian River Four Hearts Chardonnay. Um, so it's an evening of great wines, great food, great art, and a great cause that everyone can be a part of and join in this incredible event. Okay, well done. Well, we're going to bring up some of the video of um, some of the art pieces, but we want to, of course, um, shed light on exactly where the proceeds from this event go. So, Jen, where, where do the proceeds go? Um, all proceeds from this event benefit the Edward M. Cavill Cancer Foundation. Um, like I mentioned, we were formed in 2004. Um, since then, we have been able to give over $1 million um, in financial assistance to local cancer patients. So, um, you know, we are just really humbled by, by that kind of uh, uh, accomplishment and mm -hmm. also thankful to people in the community who have contributed, whether attending one of our events, you know, buying our wristbands, um, you know, sponsoring one of our events, and, and all money raised for this event will also go to the foundation. Okay, and some of the pieces that, of course, we're featuring here right now on our set, uh, the piece that I believe we're featuring right now, this is a piece by Arlene Steffi, who you mentioned uh, originally. Aside from the fact that it is truly three-dimensional. Yes. Uh, this was actually made, um, you know, did Arlene tell you the, the backstory behind this or, you know, how, how she created it? Um, she did explain a little bit and, and of course her whole explanation will be featured, you know, next to the piece of, during the art show. But this, I think, rep represents the, um, the process of 
uh, creating tuba, which is, you know, Guam's kind of original wine. Mm -hmm. So she tied in both, you know, the Guam is good theme with, um, you know, with kind of this historical perspective on, on, on wine. Uh, very clever, and I'm, I'm sure that you know this would be a very welcome piece in anybody's uh, living room and everything. Yes. Really, really nice. Now, of course, this other piece um, high up here, this is uh, of course done by Dr. Thomas Shea, a good friend of ours and of yours and everything. Um, really nice on canvas, very beautifully framed, of course, um, and it looks to be almost a hand drawn, I would think, with that three dimensional butterfly in the middle. Right, and and he mentioned that. The butterfly, I guess, represents, you know, the metamorphosis, um, but also kind of the beauty of, of the creature in which he compared to the beauty of the, the people of Guam. And, you know, despite any, you know, typhoons, economic difficulty that, the, you know, the, the people of Guam, are, you know, are, are beautiful and, and kind of maintain their beauty throughout all that adversity. So. All right. That's, that's wonderful how the, how the whole theme of the art show and, the, and uh, the wine tasting event is reflected in the art and everything. That's, that's tremendous. Yes. Okay, so um, is there anything else you'd like to add, like uh, where can people go to take part? Because obviously a lot of people are going to be very enthused about this event. Yes, um, well just once again I'd just like to invite everyone to come out, um, you know, support the Edward M. Cavill Cancer Foundation. Also just, you know, enjoy great wine, food, and just this diversity of um, you know, the, collect the collection of, of artwork created by, by these artists. Um, tickets are $50 and available at the Edward M. Calvo Cancer Foundation in Aganya or at um, Cars Plus in MIT. Okay, and if anybody would like more information about um, the foundation, um, in the interim between between now and the art show, where can they go online? Um, they can actually call 472-6854 and okay. get tickets or learn about the foundation. Okay, well, Jen and James, thank you so much for your time. Good luck with the art show. Thank, thank you. you. And the wine tasting. <laughs>